welcome back. Today's video is gonna be a good one. My car has needed this since the day I picked it up. Any guesses? Why don't you leave them in the comments below. What it needs most is headlight restoration. As you can see, these headlights are absolutely just destroyed. So much yellowing. They are not clear anymore. It makes the car look bad. Today with me, I have the 3M headlight restoration kit. There's one for each headlight. It comes with a sanding like block, um, sanding discs, and then a compound for the headlights. And then I have my own polish and I'm gonna bring my polisher just to try and get it as good as possible. But that's today's agenda. What I think we're gonna have to do is take off the front bumper because I prefer not to destroy my paint any more than I have to. Nobody ever really wants that and it'll allow me to get a better finish on the headlights overall. So that is what's gonna happen in today's video. If you guys wanna watch, go ahead and stick around. Oh, got a little surprise guest for ya. Say hi! He's gonna run into my car. One of our brothers, somebody's. Professional motorcycle rider right there. That's, that's Senor Nicholas. What's up, homie? Did you hear me? Yeah. yeah. It shoots a flame. Does it really? Yeah, if you hit red line, it shoots a flame that's like about like six inches to like a foot, somewhere in that area. You wanna see what I've done so far today? Right. What are you, are you doing? Can we get press? Um, we're doing, I did the engine bay video, cleaning the engine bay, and then right now I'm wow. doing headlight restoration. But as you can see, the engine bay is way, way cleaner. Oh my god, it looks pretty, it looks massive. I haven't, oh it's a little motor. just because I don't really know I've never done it before um, but that means that it is time to officially start cleaning up these headlights so, so you guys can see before yeah how yellow that is that's nasty these are gonna be as clear as crystal glass or whatever clear as glass after I'm done with them so go ahead and set it up and I'll get you I'll show you guys step by step how we do it just to show you guys. All right guys, so here is what is supplied in the 3M headlight restoration kit. We have a couple 500 grit pad or 500 grit sanding discs, one 1000 grit and then a few 3000 grit and then the compound right over there. Going all the way up to 3000 will definitely get you the cleanest results because it'll be super fine scratches and then you can polish them out. So that's the plus side about having a high grade sandpaper um, you can do this without a kit you literally just need like 500 grit 1000 3000 grit just like the package gives you but you can just buy the sheets um, and then some kind of compound and polish or compound and pol or compound as well as a polish um, and then a wax or ceramic coating or something uh, to coat them <music> Very rough 
scratches. It is super foggy compared to the other one that has not been done yet. But as we increase the level or the number on the grit size of our sanding discs, the finer the scratches will be and overall the headlight will start to look a lot clearer but it won't won't hit that magic clear spot until we get done and start polishing it and compounding it so let's move on to the next step which is going to be our 1000 grit can see it's a little bit clearer but you guys can't feel it but it is so smooth compared to that headlight because you just listen listen closely that is super nasty and then so much smoother <laughs> um but yeah so that is our 1000 grit sandpaper best set up to 3000 because the next one As you guys saw we hit it with that 3000 grit and it cleared it up a lot and right after that went ahead and hand polished with the compound because i don't have another polishing pad i forgot to grab another one but we are going to polish the actual headlights or we're actually going to polish the headlights with the da um, and some mcguire's 83 which is a dual action cleaner and polish so that should make a tremendous difference and I'm very very excited to see how it comes out so go ahead and show you guys that. And there you guys go. Look at that shine between those two. Look how clear that one is compared to that one. It is just like a night and day difference. As you guys saw, we just got both sides done. It's time to put the bumper back on right there and get the final shot of clean engine bay and clean headlights. It's gonna look good. I think that is gonna be the end of today's video as far as cleaning the headlights go. I think they look just so much better. That This car just looks so nice whenever it's cleaned up. Just wait until we polish it and get it looking even more immaculate, get some new wheels for it. I'm thinking about wrapping it, we'll just have to see. Um, but again, thank you guys for sticking around, watching the video. Don't forget to like if you liked the video and subscribe, it really does help the channel. Um, go ahead and post a comment down below if you want to. I'd love to have a a conversation with my my subscribers and see what you guys think uh but yeah thank you all for sticking around i will see you guys in the next one